Hello and welcome to Video Revealed. I'm Colin Smith. Who doesn't like free sound effects in music? Let's have a look at free sound effects in music in Adobe Premiere Pro. All right, Adobe offers Adobe Stock video sound sound effects and they have for many years. And you could always get to that through the Essential Sound panel. Well, now they're offering some free music and sound effects. It's really easy to use. It's synced with the timeline and it's directly inside the Essential Sound panel. Let's have a look. So I've got some uh, art list uh, clips here and I need a little bit of music for this. So there's the Essential Sound panel. There's a browse and an edit. Edit is where we go and fix anything like uh, audio uh, dialogue. But now when we go to browse, if you open up filters and turn on free, it's going to show you all of the free uh, music. And you can choose different uh, moods and different genres. And it's synced with this button here, timeline sync. It's going to sync and play. But I want to find something that I like a little bit better. I'm going to go to my moods and choose something mellow. And you can see it updates down here. And I'm going to choose R&B loop. All right, makes perfect sense for this. And if you want, you could jump ahead. And it plays where the, where the playhead is. So if you want to start part way through, you can do that. Over on the right hand side, you can see I, I have, I've already downloaded this before. There's this little three dot menu. And from here, you can go find more music from this artist, more from this album, more from this particular artist here. You can add it to the project, which is what I did. You can save it locally, and you can also save it to a library. If you're not using libraries, they make things, make organizing things great. And audio files are pretty small, great to throw inside a library. But I chose to save this uh, to the project, and it creates a folder called Stock Audio Media. So I just drag that down here. The interesting thing about this loop is uh, this particular file is a loop. So if I hold the Alt key on Windows option on Mac and drag this, it's going to loop seamlessly. That's useful. All right, let's go look at another one. Uh, here I grabbed this one, which was um, be a player loop. All right, and if we wanted to add something, uh, let's say we wanted to add some sound effects here, go to sound effects, categories, crowd, stadium crowd. Let's go to crowd cheer. And I can add this to the project. Drag that in, and now we've got the crowd. Doesn't get any easier than that. Let's look at a few more sound effects. So I'm going for ambience. And this time I'll search for waterfall.
I'm going to turn all the categories off. So that's just gives you a different feeling. Again, you could drag that in. Now, here's another one. I've already gone in and I looked for whooshes, which are obviously a very popular. And I added this to my sports logo. And I added two of those here. And by the way, I'm not using any keyframes for this. I, I, I just love film impact. All of this animation, motion blur, 3D, all of this is done with film impact. And I, I just love film impact. I, I've, I'll put a link in the description to my film impact uh, tutorial. But there you go. There's free sound effects, free music. There's thousands of them that you can use, play around with and uh, drop them in any way you want. Combine them as I did here and uh, make some beautiful compositions. Hey, if you're new to Video Revealed and you found this informative, take a moment and subscribe. You want to support us more, you can do that and download a bunch of free stuff on videorevealed.com slash shop. Donate once monthly, any amount. We really do appreciate it. Till next time, I'm Colin Smith, and it's my job to alert you to any wonderful goodies that you can get for free out there so that you can have fun making, adding sound effects and music to your projects. <laughs>